Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. How's everybody doing? Uh, so today um, I have a day off, so I just decided to take you guys along on the journey. We're gonna go check out the junkyard here in Central California. I just want to see, you know, I love going there. You know, I get sad when I go there, but you know, I just, you know, I like to see what uh, cars they have there, and you know, possibly pick up some parts as well. You know, I'm crazy like that, but. Um, yeah, so I thought you guys would like to join me as well, you know, because as you can see, uh, I'm lonely, you know, I, I don't have anybody, I have no friends, I have nothing, so I'm just going by myself. <laughs> so, anyways, um, I'm just enjoying this beautiful views of California, it's, it's so amazing, you know, I wish I had my Benz with me over here, but sometime in the future we're going to make a really nice road trip, um, possibly to this state, so we'll see. Anyways, uh, you guys enjoyed this video. Let's go. Right, guys we're actually here at the junkyard right now I'm about to park this car and we're gonna go on a journey all right guys there's a lot of different cars over here uh, BMWs Volkswagens Volvos Jaguars Mercedes and things like that and unfortunately I can't show you everything but there's a lot of a lot of cars it's pretty insane just to think about it but I'll show you a few here and there and just so you guys know we're in California so everything is clean here literally there's no rusty cars except if you see some old-school American cars from like 60s they, they might they may have some rust but usually these cars are all clean this is a W210, uh, super beautiful car, a uh, black interior. This is E320 and has all the options actually, even has the headlight washers um, and stuff like that. So when this car came to this junkyard first, they actually, like look at the condition of the steering wheel. Like it's, it's, it's like almost like new, it's pretty insane. It's pretty sad seeing all these cars here, you know? And it has all the options right there, as, as I was telling you, it even has this nice radio. I think that's factory as well and uh, long story short so yeah this when this car first came to this junkyard it was um, it was not sent to be parted out just yet all right it was actually uh, it was offered for sale but nobody bought it sadly so they uh, you know the cars that actually run drive and stuff like that they they keep them out for a little bit and offer them for sale for about three to four weeks and if nobody wants it then they actually end up in a spot like this super sad all right guys so we have this amazing 190e over here i really don't know what happened to it uh it's pretty sad seeing all these cars here what's crazy is that this car has the headlight washers this is i think 92 or 93 but nothing has touched anything on this car everything is still there and this car was also offered for sale at first so it's, it's pretty crazy if you think about it yeah it's just sad seeing all these cars here they're so nice and sweet it's locked but I mean, the inside isn't the best, but still, the steering wheel and everything is there. Pretty amazing car. All right, guys, we have a few more. We have a W124 right here, okay? Sweet car. Somebody just threw away. Okay, steering wheel feels really good too and smooth. 
168,000 miles. See, and it's crazy. Nobody's really like taking anything out of these cars in this junkyard. That's pretty crazy. M104 engine, all that good stuff. You guys have it. Now this one is a special one. This is a W140 V12. And look at this. Nobody has taken anything out of this car. Like this is insane. Seriously, it's I can't even believe it. But this car is actually like it's so clean. Like it's dirty right now, but if you clean it, like it's literally gonna be so clean. Like the leather is nice and everything only has 114,000 miles like literally it's nothing for this car. Ooh, pretty insane. I gotta tell you that. This is a literally yeah 600 SEL long body. Yeah, there's so many cars here guys. I won't be able to show you everything but so many BMWs, Mercedes, and all those cars. It's it's insane. All right, guys. Now we have a W202 C-Class. There was a slight accident. And unfortunately, literally because of that, they just sent this car to this graveyard. But... Like I said, you know, everything is so dusty here and stuff, but uh, literally all these cars are rust free. All of them. Thanks to this amazing state of California, they are super clean and everything. So, yeah, but it's just sad, sad seeing all these cars here. So, yeah. This is one of my favorite BMWs old school 7 series e3 e38 um really love this car so much and i'll probably have one of these in the future as well uh, i really love these cars um and this is a 740 740i a sweet car really love this thing but uh the main thing i'm guessing why it's here is because um Oh wow, look at this beautiful black interior. That's amazing. Oops, I gotta grab that uh, owner's manual for sure. Ooh, I need that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, unfortunately I can't grab a lot of stuff with me. Um, I would love to though. I would love to bring all these cars with me to Washington. <laughs> but anyways, going back to this engine, this engine has, you have to change the timing chain and guides on it every 100,000 miles. And a lot of people, they don't do that. Um, and when the time comes, the engine starts making rattling noises and stuff. They just give up and they want to pay for repairs, you know? So, but this is an amazing engine. It's a V8. Um, I really like this thing so yeah i'll probably get one of these if i see one for cheap that needs timing chain and guides i will scoop it up we have this trashed out e36 that looks like they were working on it and they were trying to do something to it and fix it and probably paint it but they didn't finish it I'm seeing a lot of unfinished projects, guys, which is sad. A lot of unfinished projects. There's an E60 BMW, there's a Golf right there. There's just a lot of, a lot of cars that I'm just sad seeing here. I don't know who was painting this car, but this is unacceptable. <laughs> Anyways, we have a w208 right here a sweet car a w203 guys we just have so many cars here in this junkyard a w211 right there um i mean it's pretty insane yeah i just need a really big barn guys so i can start buying all these cars saving them up so please if you're watching this video help me save all these cars just help me save all of them Wow, look at this, the E34 right there, 
That is crazy. That is super crazy. That's the W211, but this E34, there's one here, one there. This, this, it's, it's impossible to believe. That's crazy. All right, guys, we have a legendary car, BMW E30 right here. Pretty sweet car. Um, uh, this one is locked, but I was gonna show you the interior in a little bit, uh, but if you wash this car, polish it, it's gonna, it would be so nice. I mean, there's literally, there's no rust anywhere, guys. It's a brand new control arm right there. Interesting. It's so amazing, honestly saying. Such a pretty car. It's just, uh, it just needs detailing like they all do, but it's a 2.5, 2.5 liter right there. It's pretty insane. Such a sweet car. Yeah, so this is a E39 right here. There's a, a 7 Series right here and 7 Series right there. Uh, it's just a lot of cars, guys. There's a W220 over there. Let's look at this bad boy. I want one of these cars. I'm not gonna lie, I want one of these to add to my collection. It's a big, big tank. Sweet car. E30 or uh, E90. Yeah. There's so many different cars and trucks here. A lot of American trucks, pickups, SUVs, all that type of stuff. And my favorite car in the world is also here, a W123-300D. Beautiful machine. A lot of people already took out a lot of parts, but on that side, the door panels are so nice and everything. Um, it's just an amazing machine. Legendary engine right there. Yeah, that's how some people just throw these cars away, sadly, you know. That's what I'm telling you guys. Just gotta help me out. Just work with me, help me out, save these cars. You see any of these cars on the street parked somewhere or abandoned, find out who whose cars these are and just help those people out. All right, help save these amazing cars yeah there's a lot of different cars there's some more cars right there but there's mainly like two miatas right there um there's a lot of other cars it's pretty cool now it's a w126 right here as well um long body i think it's 86 or 87 yeah they Sometimes people put a lot of parts inside of these cars, but that's how it looks. And like I said, guys, this is California, so everything is dusty, everything is dirty, you know. But, you know, washing this car, polishing it would make a huge difference. Amazing, amazing car. Yep, super upsetting. To see these cars here and just dying all right yeah guys help help vito's garage to save these cars and if you're watching this video um you know just remember that you know after about five years we won't have all of these cars we barely have we'll, we will barely have any of these cars available so yeah and you know i'm not saying anything but if you guys can support my channel you know there's a, a patreon link down below if you guys can donate a little bit you know that would really help out you know i try to help people out with saving these cars and i just like you guys remember not too long ago i shipped this the same car to my dad not too long ago 
and uh, I was working so hard for about six months just to get that car back into shape and everything even though it had low miles about 160,000 miles I still went all the way through that car from the bottom to the top just to make that car amazing again because it's still even though it had low miles still needed a lot of work so yeah um, but thank you guys for watching my channel thank you so much for all your support and everything that means a lot guys thank you seriously for everything thank you for being with me and let's all grow together let's love these cars and not just mercedes let's love all the old school cars let's love the bmws as well let's not be enemies to bmws all right i also love bmws so i love old school volkswagens i love old school volvos you know i have a lot of different friends who are actually you know into those cars as well so yeah other than that i'll just show you a couple more things here and we're probably gonna end this video guys all right guys just a couple more views for you these are all japanese a lot of toyotas a lot of corolla uh, or <laughs> a lot of uh hondas everywhere a lot of nissans and stuff like that just mainly a lot of different cars whether they're japanese korean or whatever just a lot of asian cars in general nissan acura honda accord um yeah and each one of these cars has had a different uh, kind of history behind it and this is the section of domestic american cars all right i'm more interested in the old school ones such as this one pretty sweet car um lots of cadillacs a bunch of gm cars yeah buick pontiac oh i like this one oh yeah this is the chevy caprice i really love these things so much look at this thing <laughs> I think it's a caprice or uh was it the broadmaster correct me if i'm wrong but i i'm just i'm a big fan of these this thing is so spacious on the inside it actually has leather seats as well this it's a big car you know so yeah that's what it looks like but i really love the color of this one though this one is a special one boy the paint job on it is immaculate i mean except this the fender incident but who is it open okay it's open on this side no way it's a dark blue interior as well that's this thing's so sweet look at this wood this back in the day this was still a real wood same thing like mercedes and bmws used to make real wood unlike today they're all just fake wood look at the big trunk oh my goodness insane all right guys that's gonna be it for this video thank you so much for watching i'll see you in the next one leave a like and type your comment down below thank you once again and take care see you in the next one bye guys look at that pretty car I miss this thing. I miss my W210. It brings me all the memories. Somebody's taking care of this baby, looks like. They're driving it. <laughs>